What's up, YouTube? So this is the E-Cells Monarch Crown 1500 watt bike. It's kind of a all-terrain SUV uh, Hummer of uh, e-bikes, if you will. And I get to ride it today on Criss Cross. So this is a big e-bike. It weighs 95 pounds, first of all. So it's not for the uh, timid among you when it comes to e-bikes. And uh, you know, if you're a small person, this is not the bike for you. This is a big bike, um, and for taller, heavier riders, I think. And uh, it's really kind of like uh, it looks like a motorcycle. It can be intimidating a bit, but definitely a really cool-looking bike. Love the orange, and um, again, it's all-wheel drive, dual motors, 750 in each tire. These are Bafang motors. Uh, the tires are uh, 26 by four and a quarter. It is four and a quarter. Um, big tires. What kind of brakes you got on it? Tektro. Tektro brakes, mechanical or hyd hydraulic? Hydraulic. Hydraulic. Okay. So the owner is uh, just sitting across from me there. He's uh, one of my subscribers on YouTube. He uh, met me here, and we're in Chatfield Hollow State Park in uh, Killingworth, Connecticut. So. Uh, it's a great day to ride, and uh, I'm going to get this baby out on the road. But let me give you some of the stats first on what this bike is, because it is a lot of bike. It is expensive as well. You're talking about up to $5,000 for a bike like this um, on the eCells uh, website. Um, they have smaller versions that come in, I think, a 1,000-watt version uh, and some other ones, but you're talking at least three to four grand for some of those. And um, this is a really cool bike. He's got a nice Cloud9 seat on it. It's got two batteries, one here and one over here. This is a 14 amp hour. This is a 17 amp hour down here. So he's got 31 amps of total power on this bike. 750 watt, 52 volt, Bafang geared hub motors, uh, specifically built for e-cells and have a combined 170 newton meters of torque. Uh, with dual motors, you climb like a billy goat, it says, and go places other bikes can't go. Um, the controller is a 52 volt Sinway 45 amp controller. Uh, so lots of power in there. It's got uh, cooling fins as well to, to aid in heat dissi uh, dissipation. dissipation. Um, pedal assist sensor. It's got nine levels of power assist. It's IP65 uh, waterproof rated, so you can't get it wet. They actually make a hunting version of this. It comes in camouflage. Uh, so if you do any kind of hunting like that, you can uh, take this with you. Uh, it's got a half twist throttle over here. Um, again, I told you about the batteries, one in the rack, one here. Um, battery charging time, seven hours if batteries are fully exhausted. Um, the battery charger is one five amp charger fan, charges two batteries at once. Uh, it's got front lights, L, uh, let's see, LED 80 Lux headlight and a rear light equipped in rear or rack battery. Frame is aluminum alloy. Uh, it's got a front uh, air suspension sock shock with 96 millimeters of travel. Uh, rear suspension, rock shocks, Monarch RL, right here. What else? He's got uh, uh, allium, aluminum alloy seat post, 31.8 millimeters is that. Uh, grips, very comfortable grips here. That's got some drink cup bosses uh, right here, okay. And uh, the seat over post height is 19 inches with standover height of 30.5 inches. So uh, that is the E-Cells uh, Monarch Crown. I mean, this is a beast of a bike. I mean, it's, uh, it's just uh, crazy how big this thing looks. Uh, I'm six foot, so shouldn't have too much trouble standing over it. And uh, no, it's, uh, it's not too bad, but it is kind of like, I feel like I'm riding a, a dirt bike. Uh, an e-dirt bike and um, controllers right here in the middle um, it doesn't seem too tall but uh, we'll check it out on the road so so uh, quick correction so that uh, when the bike comes to you you decide what class of bike you want it on one two or three they actually give you three stickers uh, for the bike and you decide how you want to set it up so um, top speed yeah it can be fast but again uh, you don't want to break any laws there, and um, you know, uh, just keep that in mind when you're uh, getting a bike like this overall. So 
four and a quarter inch tires. Here's a look at the handlebars. Got your. Um, What's the one, two, and three here? Where? What's the one, two, and three switch? Oh. Uh, right is uh, rear motor. Mm -hmm. Center is both. Three is front. Okay, so you can run on one battery or or one yeah. one motor or the other. You know, most of the time, I just run on the rear. Um, when I'm riding on the road, there's no need to. Um, when I go on the trails, I usually go on uh, front and rear, but only on one, and twist the throttle as need be. So I'm on the uh, E cells. Is a man. It's so different riding this huge bike. I mean, uh, definitely very cool. Uh, takes a lot more concentration than uh, you know something smaller like an electric or even the friend I rode yesterday. Um, it's uh, it's just massive. I mean, it's. So speed test from zero. I'm in uh, pedal assist five. I've got both motors on. And where do you see this? Oh shit, there's a biker coming. <laughs> Jesus Christ. 16, 18, 21, 25, 26. Seven, twenty-eight, thirty-one. Holy shit, this is fucking fast. Thirty-three. That's as fast as I'm going to go. Wow. Thirty-three miles an hour. Amazing. <laughs> 